Hello and welcome to this episode of Minecraft. In the last episode we continue to explore this cave. In this episode I'm going to continue mining all of this out and we're going to try and make our bid for escape. But before I make a bid for escape I just want to go through here and take out everything on this thing. Because that will make a really cool thing. In my opinion anyway. But I do have a weapon in case I face any creatures so I shouldn't lose any of this stuff that I'm just going to collect. That's why I'm kind of doing this. If I didn't think there was like, if I thought, if I thought at any point there'd be like a risk, I would just leg it. But I'm in 100% control of every situation. I'm being dead serious, I do. I know exactly what will happen and when it will happen. And even if the worst comes down to the worst, I've got my trusty sword and I can bat away creepers. I killed a creeper! In the last episode, and I just literally killed. Well, oh, I think I just knocked something off. That's not important. That's fine. I don't know what I knocked off, but hey. Uh, I'm going to take tons of this rail. This is free. This is all this generates into this world in this man mine shaft. This is going to be so cool for my village link. Uh, but yeah, village links for the win. Anyway, where am I? I'm kind of stuck in here at the moment, aren't I? Yeah. There's a lovely river flowing underneath, underneath, underneath. He is wondering where the hell, where the hell is Aaron and his thingy in this cave. But yeah, I know I'm just going to do this, this, that and the other thing. More. Oh yeah, because that's a fence, and this is what got, got me stuck before. Whoa, that sounded uber close. It's definitely something beyond that wall, but I'm not willing to level out of your bar. Do you know? I don't want to risk it, because I've got no torches, so I can't repel them. So they could just come bombong bong me, and then I'll be taken out forever. Which would kind of suck, and I know you guys would be really sad about that, because you've been really enjoying my videos. Um, I think I have some like 21 subscribers now, which I'm quite impressed with, which is quite cool. Um, I've been having a steady increase in viewership, with my best ever episode reaching about 17 or 18 views, which is nearly everyone's, every one of my subscribing watchings at least once, which I think is pretty awesome. Can't say better than that, really. And I just want to thank everyone for continuing to support these videos because I've had great fun making them. And I hope you've had just as much fun enjoying watching them as I've had in making them. Because, yeah. I, w I don't do this just because I'm bored. I like doing this just because it's kind of a little bit fun. I don't, I don't take it too seriously. I don't take myself too seriously. And that's just kind of why I enjoy them so much. It's just because I really just don't take myself that seriously at all. So when I do do something like this, it's quite funny. No, and now, do you know what? I'm kind of glad I split this in like two episodes now because now I'm completely lost. And this part, most of this episode is going to be like trying to find my way home with no torches. Uh, and this could be interesting because now I don't even know where I am. I knew I probably shouldn't be greedy. How much, um... Oh, right, okay, I'll just make myself go down. Yeah, I have another stack full, so that's pretty cool. But I have over two stacks now of just from one system. Do you know what? I think. Knew it, you know. Cool. Oh. Oh, there's, there's, oh, it's just that. Oh, there's nothing exciting. Uh, right, now I need to find my way out of here. Up in this bit. Up there, don't get caught in the web. Then I go this way. Ah, oh, I'm so confused. Uh, maybe if I go this way. 
through the archway, this way. Oh, I might mind this while I'm here. It's gold. Gold! Always believe in yourself. You got the power to gold. All this banana. Always believe in tacos, bananas. Oh, look where I am. There is where I need him to be because I'm DT Gamer. Hey, hey, she. Even though I'm a banana master. But I will be on this channel between December. But yeah, bananas. Woo. Chips. Okay, so now I'm back where I kind of need to be. No, I better get down from there. There is so much to explore around here. There's, like, there's this area I've not even attempted to explore yet because I got so wrapped up in that. Oh yeah, and there's this segment as well. There's like so much to explore up here. Oh my god, oh and it's like, oh wow. Well actually no. I better be super careful now. I don't want another repeat of the, that saga from like many episodes back, probably the episode 11, where I like fell in the lava and lost all my resources. That was a pain in the giant lemony backside. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Oh, what's this? And right down there, I'm gonna now find my way out of here. I don't even know where I'm going. But it's probably useful to have all the stuff anyway. Uh, nope, so that probably means I'll just go around here. Nope, if I go up here. Oh, yeah, this is it. This is the direction I'm going to go. Find out where I am. Okay, so I made my escape. That's pretty awesome. But is this the way I need to go? Oh, yes. Now I can make my escape. And it's night time, I believe. So I might have to fight some mobs. That's fine. I have my trusty sword. Because I'm a trusty sword, I shouldn't have too many problems. Unless there is an enderman, and then I will have some issues. Or if a creeper decides to run down there because it's there's something up there. Is there? It's definitely sunk up here. What is it? No! Right, I'm running away. And I, I think I just saw an enderman, so I've got to run away quick. Before it spots me. And then I thought, oh no, now I've got to run. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. I've got to run. And I hope that nothing else spots me, because that zombie has kind of got me down to half health. But I am near my village. Hometown. So I can heal up when I'm back at town. That's absolutely fine. I've got tons of food, so I can just like heal myself up. But I'm gonna wait till it's like daytime again before I do so, and hope there are no mobs like nearby, so I don't have to worry about it. I think I must have avoided the Enderman. Is that something nearby? No, I think. I've... Yeah, I think I'm safe now. Just as sort of see if that zombie was following me. It's kind of half for the night. So just gonna make sure that I kind of healed up because I'm very low health, and I want to make sure I'm in my home because my home is pretty well protected. I've already lit it up. And then what I am going to do is do something that I kind of promised I was going to do back in like episode 15. And that is kind of rebuild a few things. need to build myself a couple of bits. But uh, first things first, I better heal up. So, mass carrot eating session. Yeah. I like carrots. And yeah. So, uh, what I'm now going to do, in the last recording session, I did build that uh, giant thing. What I might need to do now is kind of build stairs for it. So, what I'm now going to do is figure, try and figure out the stair recipe by myself. Okay, so, boom. Boom. Da 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 boom da 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 boom boom nope boom okay okay so ba da 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 and da 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 
Uh. Hmm. Oh, I don't even know how to build them. I have to find it out. Like, other than this. So if I go, boom. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's how you build a ladder. Okay, okay. All right, all right, I've got it now. Like, do, do. There you go. I've got it. Got 21 ladders. That's fine. Let's see how that does. But I also do need to get... Right, so at least I don't have to build those. But that was literally by trial and error. If you don't know how to build stuff, people, I highly recommend trial and error. And then I'm just... What I'm going to do is do that. Boom. Got some torches. So now I'm going to go into my thing and hope that nothing is spawned in there. But I can't rule it out at this point. So boom, 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 boom. Because now I just need to light this up in case anything does spawn in here. Can't take that risk. Because realistically, something could spawn in here and I, that I don't want to spawn. So that's why I need to light this up before anything does. Anyway, back to the staircase. Okay, there we go. Yes, then we just do that, get that. Boom, 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 boom. Oh yeah, got perfect. And, yeah. I had the perfect amount of ladders. I had one spare, that is pretty cool. Gotta admit, that is actually pretty cool. Anyway, that, I've just done that, so now I'm going to build a few, like, uh, crate things for that area, because I might put some of my resources in there, and then I might build out that little area there and see what I can do with that, that little other bit. But, uh, I need wood, I need about a couple of chests. Actually, now that will do, and then I'm going to mine out the other area and see what I can do with that. But those chests are for this area. So. Might build them along this wall here. And then just go. And. Do that. Because I can then build up tons. And there's my A-frame bit. That's the A-frame bit. That's the, This is the interior of it. I haven't really done anything that's super special for it. I might do something a bit special for it at some point, but I just kind of want to build like a bit of a frame. Um, also, I'm now going to build up this section a tiny little bit because I want to see what else is behind here. And then I might decorate it accordingly. Now I have like a suitable thing. I might just like turn this all into like stone bricks and then make this look really pretty. I don't want it already is because now it looks a bit in a mess and I kind of did it like this because I wanted to maintain the feel uh, generated from earlier zones but that's a different story for another time I'm uh, just going to mine this out there are resources at the back here so I'm just going to mine up those resources I kind of wanted to make it a bit easier. The reason I kind of started building this tunnel is I wanted an easier way to get into like my man-made cave. And I'm going to see how deep this is. Before I proceed. And then just so I know how many torch thingies it's going to take. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mine through to the other side of this. Just for the complete laugh. And see what comes at the other end. Because I kind of want this air to be interconnected. I think I might even decorate it, put a... Uh, like thing on it. Well, not a thing, but like. 
I was like planning to like build like a tunnel and then just have it linked to a lot of things. So I'm just gonna mine this out to see where I'm gonna go in on towards that. It would be kind of hilarious if I could get this link to the village. But I had do I am currently working towards getting a link between the villages that I've so far discovered because I recently found that third village and I recently got a ton of track from the abandoned mine shaft, which for the last four episodes I've been kinda of looking into. And I think that in itself is pretty cool. Yeah, and I'm just going to go do that. And yeah, wow, there's actually like... More uh, farm material here. And stuff. This is so peaceful. Oh, cool. What I might do, actually... I might explore this section. Forget what I was going to do this episode. I'm going to go explore, because I like to go explore. Exploring's a good thing. When you explore, you get to see the wonderful sights of your local area. Full of the trees, the sheep, the cows, that random beanbag friend you have over there, and many more. This could even be the same direction I'm heading, even a completely different tangent somewhere else. But I just want to see what else is going on in this world. Because I barely stepped foot out my own b base. And by not stepping out my own base, I don't even see the wide world as it is. And that's the beautiful location that is Minecraft. Live in this l luxurious location. The sheep graze in the sidings. And I eat cheese. And biscuits. Double chocolate chip of biscuit. I like biscuits. Do you like biscuits? Me too. I love them. But that's neither, neither here nor... Ooh, another cave system. Ooh, this is interesting. I love cave systems. Oh my god, I found another cave system which is completely pitch black. That might be worth investigating later. Sweet as... Cool. Mm. So that's and I found used up all the torches. So do you know what? Let's get a few things. Let's get some trees because even though I've got plenty, there is oak wood here, and I'm not letting that go to waste. Come on, it'd be a crime to waste it. That'd be just mean. Anyway, I'm gonna mine down on that, because why on earth not? And then I'm going to... Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I like this. Here we go. Um. And there you go, just go, we're gonna, gonna win, oh my god, we're gonna mine, let's get more wood, let's get more wood, let's get more wood, oh yeah, let us, let us, let us get some more wood, we kill the flowers off, let's kill the flowers off, singing songs about a monkey in a scrotal bang. But that's, um, yeah, yeah, you, you graze, you carry on grazing, why not? Because grazing's a good thing for a sheep. Oh, oh, actually, I better start making my way back because that sun gets sunset. And I don't want to play zombie fest. I'm running kind of low on health anyway, so just in case. Yeah, I think that's a smart move too. Munch on the carrot. Munch on that carrot too. Get back to base now. Uh, I know I've left that tree in a bit of funny mm. look about it. Really don't care. I just want to get back to base in one piece before the zombie hordes come and do you know what I'm going to equip my sword just in case any shenanigans happen in the meantime uh, I don't see anything right now but I've run out of torches so I just want that to get out of my way I'm just going to hit that just for the sake of and that's cool no don't get in my way obviously I will kill you I have really big things to concern myself with no, I don't have to worry about having to kill the 
That's just a sheep. That's fine. I don't want to find any mobs. No mobs, please. Well, at least the village is right there, so... No! It's a mini zo Oh. It's an ordinary zombie. I can handle that. Has he got any boots on? Oh, maybe not. Oh, there's a spider. I'm going to kill that. Yeah, oh, dear. A zombie's nearby. Oh, a zombie's right there. Oh, yeah. I'm on a roll. I'm killing this guy. Yeah. That, uh, yeah. Oh, my. And also, can I just say, I don't think I took a si Alrighty, then. I am the aerial assassin. I am robotic master. Killer of skeletons galore. And I'm going to kill it. I'm going to kill it. I'm going to kill it. And I'm gonna kill it again. And I'm gonna kill it. I'm gonna kill it. I got you kill. I got you pinned in. And there goes double. Hey, he's a bunny master, and he just won the battle, because he is the king of skeleton killers. And thank you very much for watching this episode. In this episode, we finally escaped from that giant cave. I killed a few monsters, and I am the king of all things Minecraft. This has been Robotic Master, and thank you for watching. And I'm signing off. Woo! Epic session. Woo! Beanbags.